T to the V to the L to the I to the N to the E TV line. Well, I'm here with the cast of Rain at Comic Con. I know you guys are all struggling with the plague, so it's really it's nice of you guys to be here. <laughs> Look, we were all just on a lot of antibiotics. It's fine. Yeah. yeah. You people look great always for dying. people ask that question when they're like, "Oh, if you could go back in time, what would you take with you?" And it's like, I'll probably take antibiotics. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Now, season one ended uh, with you on a quest to find your baby mama. The two of you of very, very worried back at the castle. Um, can you kind of set the stage for season two? How do things pick up? As king, I've made the first decision as king to be. be impulsively go and look for my baby mama <laughs> um, uh, and find out hopefully they're hopefully they'll they're gonna make it through the plague uh, so Francis gets um, trapped out in an area um, what's which terrifying is, is how fast the plague truly could affect you and you would be dead within a very within like short 48 hours that. amount of time which it's is true. so fast as soon as yeah. you started presenting symptoms it right ra raced through your lymphatic system so fast yeah. you mentioned his first uh, act as king how how is he as a king what's he what's he like right now he's sort of dealing with things on a much per more personal uh, level and it's, i find it funny that Francis really likes to go out of his way to really do everything himself. <laughs> like, <laughs> even though he's king of the country, he'll do things, he'll go out and he'll do things himself. Like, there's a war, he went out and fought it himself. There's a baby, he could have sent somebody else, but he wants to go and find oh. that baby. Yeah. Um, uh, but when he, when he gets back to the castle, um, he'll have to start making some political decisions. And also, uh, you know, Mary, I know she keeps growing and, and sort of having to come into growing, her own. Oh, growing, growing, growing. She is, she is a giant woman. Massive. She is She's metaphorically growing, <laughs> coming into her own, um, and kind of, uh, you know, taking charge of things. So how is she going to continue to, to grow in season two? I think we're going to really see her sort of struggle with Queen Catherine to kind of take that place as the Queen of France. It's going to be a power struggle there, which I'm very excited to play are, out. Are you now Queen Mother? Is that your title? Yes. Queen Mother, yes. <laughs> yes, I am Queen. Um, Mother. I think uh, <laughs> with the, spoiler alert, return of Lola and the baby, that whole situation I think is going to stir up a lot of trouble for um, or not. our love birds. I probably will. I, I have a feeling that maybe, you know, having her best friend's baby who also happens to be her husband's child around is going to be very difficult for Mary, especially since she hasn't had a child yet and there's fears that she might be barren. And, you know, the baby is like a marriage of two people that she loves more than anything, but also represents like the ultimate betrayal by two people that she loves more than anything else. So I think having that around is going to be very, very difficult for her. And uh, is, is, I know you guys are, are, you know, trying to make an heir. Is that still your... Your yeah, get on we'll be shagging, it'll be fine. <laughs> yeah. Come on. There'll sex. be more sex Give me scenes, this. I'm sure, coming up. That's good. Well, speaking of Both shagging... Both with each other and... <laughs> maybe with other what what I want to hear this segue. What a great yeah. place to get cut up. Speaking of shagging, uh, I know there's some, some new people coming to French court, maybe a uh, certain... Maybe Nars I get to shag a somebody certain, finally. A certain, a certain Narcisse. I mean, look, Nostradamus, hey, he's, exactly. he's with another now. Yeah, I know. Narcisse is exciting, and he's a wonderful actor. Yeah, he's really good. He's, he's got an handsome. amazing voice. Great voice! For the musical episode. Yeah, for the musical episode that's coming up. <laughs> that we have coming up, like in Buffy. Uh, will he be using it to seduce one Catherine? One queen Well, mother? I think what's interesting is that he when we first sort of see him, there's something that has me on alert around him because he's very powerful. And one of the dynamics that sort of comes up for me is the politics and trying to get across to Mary that in fact, people who have a lot of power are the noblemen. Yeah. The nobles actually are the people with the power that we are beholden to them. We may be the rulers, but they are the people that are making the decisions. Yeah. They are the lobbyists of the 1500s. I, I thought that once I got into power that it would that would sort of be it, that I could do what I want, but actually I have to answer to so a he's whole a, bunch of people yeah. that I have to manage and Red tape. who have their own agendas. So he's a very powerful nobleman and I think I recognize power, and my immediate thing is, is how am I going to make this work for me? Uh, now, speaking of noblemen, there is one very noble man missing from this, this group. Another excellent segue. Frash hug, I think, was the thing on Twitter when, uh, when Francis and Bash hugged in the, in the finale. That was I was beautiful. touched by that. Brosy P. Oh, yeah. Tell me. Tell in the me new that. episode? We hug like three times. <laughs> <laughs> I know that that moment went down really well, so they were like, just put it in everywhere. <laughs> we're hugging every All time hugs, Every time we see each other, we're doing it. Will that relationship continue? Will you guys still be good? Because I know that's always very touch and go. I do say at some point to him, I need someone that I can trust to him. So I think we're at the stage now where our relationship can build, even though not that long ago he did. He was engaged, yeah. engaged to my wife. <laughs> well, he's, um, married. he's married to one of my best friends now, and they're in love, I guess. Yeah, they're in. For the moment, they're in love. There's just a lot of sharing at French Court. I know he's not here. Can you say? It's French Court. What did you expect? <laughs> I know. Can you say what, what might be happening with those two? I know they're not here, so let's talk about them. I love their relationship. It's so funny. Something... Bash and Kenna? They're both kind of snarky. Yeah, they are. 
Make actually, I, they, they're the, the two they actually that have had to develop into something, which is fantastic yeah. that they yeah. were thrown together. The best Twitter question I got for all of you, since he's not here, is will it ever be addressed that Torrance has beautiful eyes? Sometimes That's why I, I don't look, I talk. try not to look at him, because yeah. if I do, I get drawn right in. And the <laughs> queen's in. gone into Oh, God, I got lost in your eyes again. Uh, long, long, eyes. Longest hug ever. Damn you, your Boston eyes. <laughs> um, now, no offense to any of you or any of the oh. other cast members. Here we go. Uh, <laughs> Segways are just either just really good or really bad. One. I want to talk about my favorite character, which is Clarissa. Oh. Out there somewhere hiding. Yes. I talked to Lori McCarthy and she, you know, she said, yes, of course she's alive, maybe out there. What do you guys think she's doing? She's gone Rambo. She's out there. It's like <laughs> I did some doing? sort of montage of her like working out and getting really strong <laughs> so she can come back to the castle and take everyone on, putting on putting on dinner, 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 bum 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 running through the jungle. Like she's found a witch to fix the her face so that she can like yeah. <laughs> Put that potato sack back on, cut the eye holes out. Yeah. And just kill. Yeah, just everybody. kill everyone. <laughs> I think yeah, that's, that's, that's how the show will end, with Clarissa coming back and slaughtering everybody in the castle. <laughs>